Hello, bonjour, que pelo. Yes, I am into orange. It took me 31 years to accept it. I really love orange. It happens to be the color of La Maison Hermès. Her mess, my mess. So last week I went to Mexico City. There they have the whole range of beauty, which came out like last year when the world stopped. I couldn't go and see them and shop for them because like they're not available online, not here in Mexico at least. I went and I caved. We have a little bag with a little box which came beautifully wrapped. This is like two trips. One was when I got this one and the unboxing I will add right now so that you get the full experience. In this trip I bought exclusive summer color and the blush and I really want to try it on. I am very Hermes decked today. This Martin Margiela leather jacket and my Collier de Champ which I actually got 10 years ago. And I could have bought an orange one or this tan color and I I was very tempted on the orange one but it was gold metal. Anyways, long story. So let's open this and try it and play around with it. And it was a really bad idea to wear a leather jacket because it's kind of warm and I am melting. So we are still in an orange vibe. It's a little bit more of a popsicle orange, a halter moment. Um, yes, I could have worn the Margiela halter cardigan but it's cashmere and it's really warm so we're not gonna go there. The scent that I'm wearing, this is new-ish fragrance from Hermes. This is H24, which is H24, like 24 hours, kind of, sort of, I don't know. This is supposed to be male fragrance but scent has no gender so I rest my case. This is citrusy, fresh, clean and I use this every day, as you can see, I've gone through quite a significant amount of liquid. And this is refillable and I love the little diamond shape of the bottle, so this is recyclable, you can just buy the, the liquid. That's not new with Hermes, they, I have another one, which is, I don't remember the name, I'm gonna go try to find it, and you can buy the liquid and refill it, so it's not new for Hermes, but whatever. Um, so, it came very beautifully wrapped with the tissue paper that it's right here. And the first lipstick that I got, um, which was a gift, not from Hermes, they don't like me that much. This, it comes with it, its little dust bag, which I, I, I appreciate. Because if I'm gonna have this in my bag, this is heavy, this is very luxurious, beautiful. Yes, satisfying magnet. I will do a little bit of a close-up. I had to go for the orange what? Which is orange box, which is the same color as, you know, the iconic Hermes orange box. I love orange lipstick. I own a lot of orange lipsticks. And this is a matte orange. A couple of months ago, they came out with the blush, which, I mean, okay, hold on. If you know, you know that Pierre D, the shoe designer, the guy who designs shoes for Hermes, the guy who has his own brand, very architectural, very cool, he is the designer of the packaging of this beautiful lipstick compact case. Beautiful white, gold, black accent with this coin emblem and it's not centered, it's a little bit, it's such little details that really, really give you the whole experience. This has a bit of a medicine scent. It's not floral. It might be floral, but I don't smell like rose. No, it's soft, it's cute, and it's... However, however, this one, you might have noticed, doesn't come with a dust bag and um, I'm sorry, but if I'm gonna have this in my bag, I don't want this to get scratched because, okay, this is another thing. They are refillable. You can pop the tin 
and you can have a replacement, a new blush if you finish your current blush. So that's cool, but I would have appreciated this to have a little dust bag. I mean, if they went there with the lipstick, they could have easily gone there with the compact, you know? But whatever, I, it's not cheap. And the lipstick that I got comes again with a little dust bag. And you know what? Something to notice is that the cardboard in this one is a little bit thinner. I mean, nobody really cares, but... If we're gonna go there, we're gonna go there. And I bought the Summer Limited Edition color, which is Beige Ebloui. Tanny beige, I love it. Perfect. My lips look better. They have a scent. Kind of medicinal, but like mm, beautiful, soft, luxurious, right? This is a satin. It's very nice. So I have a plan. I kind of want to do something that I shouldn't, but I want to, because I am crazy like that. Even though this nudie color goes perfectly with the packaging, I, I am crazy like that. Yes, you just pull them out and you can switch them around and I, that's what I'm gonna do. First, oh, okay, oh, let me go closer. I'm not gonna scoot you over, I'm gonna scoot over to the camera to show you the details because this is beautiful. So this is the box you, you see, this is how you open it and there is the little dust bag. This material is the same dust bag as the bags come with, classic, this is not the special edition, this is the one that is normal, I would say. Beautiful emblem, that Hermes thing right there, ooh, beautiful, very luxurious, right? And when you open it, yes, I have I've used it and I ruined the top. It was a long story, which involved me trying to get a photo. This is orange, what? The limited edition summer lipstick with the orange beige ebloui. This beautiful nudie color. For the blush, here we have this. Do this. We have the compact. This little divot here is beautiful voila you see it's not perfectly centered Maybe. now that we're here can you tell the difference in how thin and flimsy this is and how more rigid this is like those are little details but i don't know but still feels nice looks nice will be perfect for my bag but that's that's where we are right now so i've learned that on a daily basis I am a very lazy person. I am a very lazy lazy. I, I'm not a blush person, but I'm a bronzer kind of a gal. So this is like the perfect in-between. Kind of rosy, tanny, bronzer. So this is like an all-in-one shade. They have brushes, but I, even though I have a bit of a thing for brushes, I know my limits. I'm trying to work on that foreign concept that is bad. So I didn't go for the brushes because because I don't need another brush, to be honest. They, they are beautiful. But um, one thing that I noticed, they have like a regular blush brush, kind of like this, angled. And they also have like a little kabuki brush. It's very cute, but if that is intended for the bag, I prefer this Chanel brush that I have that comes with a little cap. It's more portable and it won't ruin your bag. Oh, I don't know how that one works, if it has a little case or if it whatever, I don't know. And I didn't really went there. If I'm gonna have this in my bag, I'm gonna have it with this brush. That's me personally. So let's try this. So this is a Burberry blush brush and we're gonna go there, okay? It's a matte bronzer.
and I've fallen for the trend of having a little bit on my nose. This is the perfect kind of like sunburned blush color. I'm going to use a little bit here on my forehead just to balance the color a little bit. And you know what I do on a daily basis when I really like I want to get ready quite fast? I use a little bit on my lids. Like that yes I like this is it worth the money I don't know I don't know well now that I have it will I use it yes yes maybe I will finish I would so first I want to try the summer color I always use my lipsticks from the back I don't like ruining the front also I think it's better for no liner kind of thing Oh, this combo is... I like it a lot. But I want to end this with an orange lip because I'm in the mood. So this lip is basically $5 maybe, I think. So... Voila! I really like orange. It's like, I, I, I really like how I look with a red lip, but I feel like an orange lip is a little bit more daring and it really goes well with my color i think because i have a lot of yellow undertones in within my skin i i tan very easily because i'm a latina so orange i think goes very well with my with me i've just learned how to accept and deal with that so i really think this is the best blush of them all i'm not a pink kind of girl i don't look i mean i can use pink but i don't feel I look like me. Orange and tanny colors. This is the perfect one and done. That's it. Thank you so much for watching and until the next one. Oh my god, I just received this major gift from Hermes. I am shooketh to the core. I collect all of this and I love them. All right, let's open up this one this one is a little bit lighter so i don't know what's in here oh a lipstick this is in orange what Oof. i love such a beautiful packaging Oh my god, this is the exact color. Oh my god. Look at this. Wow. Don't have this size at all in anything. This is a heavier box. I don't know what's in here. Oops. Oh my god. This smells so good. These are, I guess there are soaps. Oh my God. This smells so good. Oh my God. Yes. Oh, and in case you didn't know, I collect Le Monde Hermes or El Mundo de Hermes and all of the different brochures that they've given me throughout the years. I even bought, I bought the coloring book that's back there. These are so cute. Yes, I love these. But, I noticed these are in Chinese. I don't know, that's me being completely ignorant. But wait, there's more. We got Rouge Amazon Satiné. I love the way this box is open. That's so new for... And this little dust bag for the lipstick. Beautiful. Wow.